Okay, I think um, I'm prepared for this. I wanted to do a series where we literally start from the bottom and try to make our way back up to the top. So what I did <clears throat> was um, D-rank, and it was painful, but Online. I'm officially <laughs> 975. And that's not all. All right, uh, we're going to try to climb, but we're going to actually try to learn, the, like, relearn the game. I actually honestly think that you start off a little bit too high in the elos, and um, at 1200, I think, is, like, where I started. So I really think that it would be really awesome to experience the game from a lower elo and make your way back up. So let's see. I'm going to try my best not to use heavy attacks and I'm going to try to practice reading and uh, movement because movement is something that I'm just still really bad at. So here we go. Let's see if we can get our first win. Ada has low defense. So it shouldn't be that bad to deal with her, especially since we're playing such a high level, um, oh god, such a high defense legend, we sh I mean defense, nice high attack legend, we should have no issues. Sadly he disconnected, that's okay, I mean it's literally understandable, I was in... 1677 at some point last season, so, um, you know, it's gonna be like this. I got the idea kind of from Boomy, seeing that he went from literally a smurf to diamond in like a day. Um, I'm not expecting that that's gonna happen for me, but I thought that it'd be pretty interesting to experiment and see what is my, um, what's the highest that I can get and where will I get landlocked? Because I was getting locked. Uh, I was getting locked around, I think it was like 1550 or 1480. I couldn't go up uh, at some point, um, I think in the sixth season. But then this season I was like doing pretty decent and got myself up to 1670. But, you know, how it is. You kind of go on a kind of go on a losing streak. You get a little bit tilted like I did and um, I just kept on losing. I, I, I honestly kept on losing and then I just thought just, just just die guys. Let's just keep kill let's give my elo away and try to make my way back again up the ladder. So that's what I'm going to try to do here. I'll, I'll record these in episodes. Um, hmm. And then, um, try to make my way up and see how it goes down. I can't talk while playing most of the time because I'm just like actually kind of bad at multitasking. So I thought it'd be pretty good practice as well just to talk and game at the same time. So here we go, we're going up against a Diana Bowguns. The thing I don't like about Diana is that her SIGs are very, um, they're very perfect. Like, you can seriously get so much mileage out of her everything. Lots of air starters, which is actually what she is doing. Jump read next time, possibly. Oh, jumped away. Six to finish me off, even though I'm yellow. Probably gonna neutral sig. Yeah, she was. Dodge, dude, you have a dodge, don't you? Disconnected, okay. So yeah, we're gonna make our way up and... Hopefully we don't get beat by the bot. I actually get beat by the bot. That's actually sad. Yeah, so I also got no board set up and I deleted a few keys I don't use and keys that um, I think I'm gonna use, I kept on. 
just for your sake so you can see what I'm doing I guess even though um, I'm literally just a high gold I'm not even that good yet but I think it'd be perfect for learning too uh, on my behalf like what is it that I'm probably doing what could be wrong here uh, that kind of stuff so yeah um, okay bot Oh shit, neutral light, dude. <laughs> no side seat. We actually lost a stock to the bot. That's kind of sad. If they put the bot on hard, I actually think I could possibly lose like Elo to a bot. I actually honestly think that. Okay, there we go. We're good. All right, here we go, guys. We're gonna do it gonna be kind of boring in the beginning because what I've noticed in this elo is yeah it's just a lot of people who possibly have either never played fighting games or um, don't understand the mechanics yet that's what I've seen um, if not they're just literally spamming and they're just guessing at this point I mean I kind of like I kind of do the same thing I don't even know how the heck I'm as high as I was before but I guess I just get lucky. So here we go. We're going to go up against a Cassidy on Fangwild. Epic thing about Fangwild is that this is a very notorious place for lateral gameplay. So people like me and Cassidy are going to actually have a lot of fun, depending on how good this person is with guns. I should also practice recovering back to the stage because it's actually something I don't do often either is practice something like as fundamental and basic like that so jump next time jump read oh, I was hoping I can hit that Oh, what the fuck? Come here, dude. I keep throwing my lance away. I should really consider not doing that. Um, away, in again. Oh, he did go in again. Bait out the sig. Oh, he went inside. I thought you'd like go in. And there you go. There's the kill. Alright, let's keep going up. GG, dude. Thanks for staying for GG. That's something I appreciate. Yeah, so... A lot of stuff here is still me not really thinking. I'm still not completely thinking. I should really be thinking. Thinking every single time, all the time. Gotta do that. Here we go. From zero to nothing, basically. All right. Sig again, sig again. Doesn't know for the dodge in, so I can get away with that and punish. A little bit airy. Oh, a little bit slow there with the rig. Side sig and done. Okay, so he goes in. Um, no air, no aerial entries though. Something I learned from my boy Coslix. He's Canadian too, so it's pretty great. Oh, I was hoping I'd catch him with the down air, but I guess not. And there you go. He could have totally, um, could have totally just dodged up, I think. I don't know if there's a sig that is safe enough for, um, side sig again. Stay still. Oh my god, I was hoping that that would connect. Pump throw. Oh, 
I thought you go in. Okay. Ooh, I went into the sig, dude. You just no, it does down sig. There you go. I never get people with that side sig. People space it out actually quite a bit because I think they're expecting the um, they're expecting the side air. So I should actually consider always baiting that, baiting out the spacing because that's something I don't do. Um, there's like a dodge in, and you can go around like that. Or you don't even have to do the you don't even have to do the dodge. The dodge is more of like you know what they're going to. Um, like a scythe, 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 uh, neutral light, I think, is going to, I have enough time to get out of that and go for a side air that way. So, um. It's not giving the weapon no mercy. Lots of jumpy play. I don't know what he's doing. Bruh. This is the people that I honestly hate then also need to learn how to play against. So he knows what he's doing in terms of fighting. That's a for sure. Oh, you could have, um, what's it called? You could have, uh, chase dodged. That's what he could have done. No jump. I always go for that. No jump to stays. Spot dodge. Neutral sig again. Down sig. Side sig. Neutral sig. He's prepared with the hammer recovery. Oh my god, I keep getting that wrong, dude. The spacing for that has to be just perfect. So I have to always be dynamic with that. Cider should get him. Oh god, he went too low. I think it's either he doesn't know how to recover or something. I don't know. He doesn't know guitar strings. That's for sure. From what I've noticed, he doesn't know any strings yet. No jump. Recovery, down air, recovery. Cider should end him? Okay, good. Dude, I actually am bad. I'm not kidding you. I'm still throwing random shit out. That's kind of bad. Come on, Seth. All right. I lost some elo with um, thatch, I think, as well. I was throwing with thatch a little bit, and it was kind of odd using guns, because um, I think I switched around weapons a lot, but I honestly stuck with lance no matter what. And then hammers just because of bodvar, honestly. Because I played a lot of bodvar before, and I really loved it. Same with Roland. Sir Roland was really awesome for sword and lance, but it's just... You know how it is. Okay, Robot Boy again. This is the guy that does a lot of recoveries and down airs. And he does a lot of just sigs with um with everything. He doesn't seem to dodge and he doesn't seem to go he seems to go down a lot. So lots of side sig, down sig, very safe sigs, recovery. Ground pound. Because this stage is actually very easy to kill off the top, I actually might either consider ending him with a SIG, or I have to go for something a little bit more challenging. So let's try to go for Mafias, or side air kills. Um, especially like Zero to Death with Lance. I don't know what he's doing, man. Ground Pound. Why is he ground pounding with guitars? And I got hit by that too. That's again how you know that I'm not good yet. If I can get hit by simple tomfoolery like that, I am not good. I'm just throwing shit out. 
Honestly, I really don't know where he's going. Please get out of my face. Please, what are you doing? Um, he's gonna go for the weapon. No, he's not. No jump? Oh, he jumped this time. He knows how to gravity cancel, but he doesn't do it with weapons, which is kind of dumb. See what I mean? It's so stupid. Side air? Okay. He could have dodged, I think? I think he had a dodge. I swear he had a dodge. He should have had a dodge. It's okay. Let's keep going. I don't know how long I want this video to be. I might just do the whole thing. Just do as high as I can get and then stop. Like once I lose, I'm done. Kind of thing, I guess. I mean, it's gonna happen once I hit gold. I'm gonna lose a lot of games. Um, there's a lot of people in gold that are actually decent. And there's a few people in silver that actually know their strings. And um, they're hitting them pretty good. And, and some read actually kind of ridiculously well. So this Orion is just nice and unarmed. Um, nice weapon tosses. See, this guy right here is actually challenging. I wouldn't be surprised if he is like not supposed to be here or something, you know? That's the thing I don't get. Cider, dead. Okay, good. Off the stage, always go for the side light cider. Bread and butter. Is he gonna dodge? No, he doesn't. Zero to death. He doesn't jump, which is good. Nice side sig. Going down. Nice side, uh, nice neutral sig. Recovery, try to finish me off. Yeah, this guy is actually a warrior. I give him props for that. Neutral sig, of course. No helicopter, which is awesome. I don't want him to be dealing with that, please. Oh, of course the helicopter. At least go for a downer, dude. You're actually, you're pretty smooth. Not gonna lie. Don't, don't taunt, dude. That's honestly how you lost that. All right, here we go. All right, here we go. Going in, going in ham. I still don't know why I'm not hitting the frame rate that I really should be, but it's all good. I really don't care at this point. All right. Oh, Matthew messaged me, butthole. It's all good. Just keep going in. Let's go ham. Let's do it. Okay, so. Yeah, these people actually know what's up now. So these people are going for weapons, trying to be aggressive, that kind of stuff. Oh, try to use less sigs, Seth. Less sigs. Although they're using sigs, try to use less. Dude, it's one of these people. If I lose to one of these people, it just means I'm bad. So let's keep going. Dissect a problem here. So this guy literally just sits and waits for you to wait and make a to make a mistake. The guns are going to be the worst. Yeah, they're going to be the worst. They have the most spike potential. So waiting for the right moment to strike is what's going to help us here. 
I just want to hit them with the neutral sig all the time. See, finishing is something I have issues with. There you go. Yeah, I have issues with finishing. That's the issue I have. Dodge away. Dodge. Oh, just instant wake up. I gave him the weapon. Jump read next time. No, nothing. I actually am always scared of guns and bow. Guns and bow, so people like Diana, which is the only person, is the most annoying for me. Of course, there's other legends that have other weapons, but I really don't, I don't like it. Oh, I want to finish him with the D-Sig. There you go. <laughs> but of course, it's all, it all makes sense now. Let's climb, let's climb, boys. Let's climb. Get out of here. All right, so. Honestly, yeah, uh, I just really wanna get most of this down here. And then I think this will be perfect for like watching and stuff. Like, I swear I do have a tendency to spam the keys a bit too much, but that's just to make up for the fact that the keyboard is literally a Dell keyboard. I swear. I mean, that can't be an excuse, right? It's all just logic at this point. If you know there's something wrong with the equipment, learn to adapt. Uh, I think the ghosting on this is four keys or five. So I can only press so many keys at once. Hammer. Oh yeah, he has the best SIGs in the game that are perfect for someone like me. His SIGs are anti-airs and um, are the most annoying. And he plays at the edge like a butthole. So. Unless I read him like that, I should be good. But I shouldn't be reading with sakes. I should try to read and hit with proper technique, such as light attack. Something like that. That's a uh, down sick, I think, is what he just did on me. to go around down air, down light didn't work for the punish recovery right there you just take the finish but nothing side light to cider come on oh the step back didn't work okay <sighs> lots of range with that hammer and the ground pound I don't want to end it that way though I do want to actually be classy use my light attacks you know, that kind of stuff. No jump, he fast fell down. Moves into me for the wake up attack. So that's a nice side sig. He doesn't know anything. He jumped up. Okay, try to go for the jump up read. Oh, I didn't dodge up. My bad. Dude, I might lose to Preston. Dude, I might lose to Preston. Oh, I keep going in. There's a lot of active frames on the neutral light. Okay, let's see if I can do it. Uh, that was the next pivot. I didn't want to do that though. I want to dodge. I want to. I want to jump in, and then I wanted to. Um, okay, so I gotta practice that. So jump in, dodge out, and fade into the attack. It kind of like it kind of messes up with their timing, and that's something that you can do with hammer. And I saw Cost likes to do it a lot. It's such a perfect maneuver. And then I have to start trying to dodge away from the sig if possible. Okay, Nix. If Nova is not good at scythe, I'm good. Um, normally guns and bow are my like. Bane, but on top of that would be someone like a scythe player like Nyx, especially a Nyx, um, especially because of those guns. Recover. 
recoveries, down airs, side lights. I mean, he could be reading me for all I know, and this is all an act. Some people are like that, where like, they act all dumb, but then they're actually like hella smart in this game. No, he's just running away. I didn't mean to do that, but it worked out. Oh, he knows I float now. Of course. Unless he doesn't know that, and I'm just predicting how good he is. Sometimes I hold people with high regard, but... I don't know why he's just running away. Fight the battle. Neutralite doesn't kill? I was gonna say, I'm actually bad at ending people, dude. I just need to find the most consistent ways that uh, my weapons kill. And normally it's a, it's an air move of some sort, or it's going to be um, a recovery. Especially, yeah, it's normally an air move. Um, those are the safest bets if it's not a SIG on hammer. Um, I almost died there. This is how he gets easy kills, because, um, you know, Lance is probably the only weapon that I have a lot of range with and I can cover, but then Hammer has a little bit of issues of chasing, so I have to really rely on proper reads if I want to get, like, anywhere there. So, so I like to jump up as soon as I'm near. Nice gravity cancel. He has some knowledge. He's just really passive. Something again that I need to just learn how to get good at dealing with. So. He couldn't come back. So I just have to get really good at that. Yeah, he disconnected. Okay, thank the Lord. I don't want to just focus on one person, please. Oh, what? Oops, I was stacked too. Neutral light wouldn't have been able to hit. I could have like, I could have done so much more. The more I think about it, um, if I was chasing him, I could have tried to actually like not just dash. I could have tried to, um, in a sense, wave dash or dash jump. We're out of tin and we're in silver now. So let's go. So Orion. So things I don't like about Orion. Side sig. Um, side sig. Uh, a side sig. There's a lot of things I don't like about Awar Orion. So let's just see how we can deal with, with this. He knows what's up at least. No dodge up. He does know what's really powerful with Orion, especially against something like Lance. What's really dumb is that Lance sometimes is going to be out um, maneuvered. So is he gonna ground pound? Time for me to end his uh, whole career with a simple move. There you go, down here. So I've, been, I've, been, I've practiced that um, move a little bit, and that's just something I just need to get good at, though, because um, no dodge up again. Side sig, perhaps. Orion's like to go for side sig, or new, or down sig. Yeah, there it is. 
Oh, downsig again. Is it downsig? No, downsig's the twirl. Uh, it's uh, that's neutral sig. I have to get my sigs right. And there's the end. I have to always remember happy ending with that down light side sig. I mean, side light. Side sig, of course. Easily dodgeable, but then not that read. Someone goes for something like that. Oh, he kept jumping. <sighs> When someone always goes for that side sig, I actually tend to get followed up by a neutral sig all the time with Orion. So, got to be very careful and cautious of that, because um, that is the most annoying thing that could ever happen to you. I think the lag is kind of helping too, because some of the frame perfect hits um, comes a bit slower at me. So, you know, it's kind of odd. If you ever watch gameplay of like pro players, it looks so fast because their movements is good, but for me, it looks like it's in slow mo because of the lag from the I think the recording and then. Um, just everything, so. So let's try to incorporate that dodge thing. I need to incorporate that a lot, because uh, I haven't been able to do that. So let's do this. Here we go. Perfect. And we're in. Uh, he, Petra knows what's up, though. Petra knows what's up. If I remember Petra's correctly, they really love doing that um, that sig, but it looks like he doesn't really care about that. The read of the dodge in. And that's the ending. Okay, a disconnect, easy elo, I guess, for us. I actually hate orb. Orb is the most annoying thing. Like, right there, that is the most annoying string to get hit by. Just because, okay? I mean, there's probably a way that you can dodge out of it that I'm just not aware of, but until I find that, I don't even know how to fix that problem, dude. Side sig. Please. Can I hit the double mafia? Oh, no, I can't. All right. Here we go. We're going to pop off. We're almost at 1,200, which is exactly where I'd want to be by 50 wins. Actually, that'd be nice, but I doubt it's going to happen. <gasps> Mordex caught the bomb. That's a big no you moment. Okay. Thank you. Okay, Ada, the animal man. So... I think at this elo, I should be expecting sigs coming out. The one thing that I will never expect will be D-sig. We have to end his career, like right away. Like right away. There you go. Because I don't want him to be getting any kind of support from those guns. Especially from the SIG, because neutral SIG is the safest SIG, which um, is just a fact. It's a fact, okay? So we gotta go fast on the ADA and be aggressive. Yeah, there's the SIG number one. SIG number two. Ground pound, of course. Kind of saved him, especially in a real match. That would have been over. 
Now dodge up. Is he? <laughs> he just killed himself. <laughs> no, Ada, you're you're the man for taking that pounding. I just had to really give it to you because I don't want to deal with you. I know what kind of a player you're probably most likely going to be like. Dealt with them so much before, and it really hurts. The one thing I'm really bad at is the... What's it called? Is Yeah, it's just chase dodging. Chase dodging is hard for my setup because W is not only my aim up, but it's also my jump. I don't know if you noticed that. So some of my combos I've been able to hit because I use spacebar a lot more often now. But um, before, this guy's actually trying to move, which is something I can appreciate. And there's the sig read. I always go for the double neutral sig. I think no one ever expects it, but especially now, it's going to be probably expected by him. Neutral sig. And also go for the down air all the time, which is not actually a good option considering that there's better options out there, like the side air, with hammer I mean. So I should really get out of that habit. It's just um, a string that I always practiced to get that right. Oh. sig. But instead, it was the recovery. <sighs> I gotta really think about what I'm doing, Seth. Don't just be randomly hitting up moves like that. Or else you become just like them. And you're not gonna get any better. I think he meant to go for the side air read or something. Oh, ground pound hits the neutral sig. Perfect choice by Janksley right there. I'm not gonna outspace the the lance, uh, not the lance, the scythe mix-up. The thing that's weird about scythe is that there's no better mix-up besides a scythe to go up against a scythe. Um, I, I almost, I honestly believe that and stand by that because almost every single weapon, in terms of the matchups, they're just really good. Okay, good. They're just really good against each other. Um, they're not good... Uh, every other weapon's not good against another scythe. It's just kind of weird. That's what I find. Like, even me, I should be able to outrange the scythe, but I get played. Even if I play something that's a little bit more offstage worthy, like Gauntlets or Katars, I find that they still struggle a lot because scythe is just, hey, pretty good, you know? So, it really hurts. Um trying to get up there. Oh, Axe is just cancer. Um, he seems to be the kind that just... He had the same idea as me. I don't know if you noticed that, but that was actually epic. He should have touched the ground, dude. You're actually good, Rayman. Not in terms of the matchup, but you're the player who's playing him right now is actually good. Side six should kill. I mean, side light, side air, dude. I don't know why he goes for ground pound on the stage. Don't do that. It's 
it's kind of a dumb thing to do. It's a little bit easier to read of what he's going to do. He's just spamming up weapon like attacks at this point. <gasps> was that ground pound? It was ground pound, I think. That was actually an epic move from. I actually meant to pick up the weapon, but. And neutral sig, and that noise was epic. Jesus Christ, let's climb. 300 elo, dude. I don't know how much how much more I can take. There's just going to be outliers, though, where there's like completely really good people out there. Um, it's happened, and I, I don't really get it. All right, Artemis Thunder. So, of course, the two weapons I hate going up against. I don't like other Lance players. Because I think it's demoralizing to lose to the weapon you main. Let's let's be real here. When it happens, it's it is a little bit sad and it and it sucks because you're just like, dude, oh, I know this guy, I think. He's gonna fall for down air down light again, like over and over again. Okay, let's just actually try to hit stuff though, Seth. Weapon toss in. This Orion, I mean, this Orion? Artemis. Artemis actually knows what he's doing. Side, side air. And recovery. Yeah, he actually knows what he's doing. So, I'm done. Won't be able to win that. He taunted too. Oh, thunder. Thunder, you awakened. You awakened a lightning, man. I hope you're ready for the sting when I'm done getting red. Like a buck. <laughs> Shit. Neutral sig all the time. That's like the only sig. Goes around for the weapon. Oh, I should have let go a lot more earlier. Side sig? I thought he'd side sig again. Oh, that that sig is really good. I actually wanted to go for a turnaround in case that he let go a little bit too more, uh, just a little bit more earlier than me. Dodge away, sig. Oh, the lag was real. I don't know what he's doing. Oh, shit. And there you go. I actually didn't mean to throw it at myself, but I guess the kamikaze worked out. All right, we're back basically where we started in this game, like from the beginning, dude. Like this is this is the elo where everybody that's like right getting into rank, I think, starts. Um, if they didn't have their account for however many long years or whatever. So here we go, going against a Nai. Um, neutral sigs and side sigs and down sig, though specifically with um oh i was really thinking they could go for side sig i guess not dodge away i thought he'd go for attack hammer throw in neutral sig side air bomb toss That was a perfect dodge from him. But he couldn't follow up. Honestly, he had me there. I will give it to the Nye that he had me right at my ropes there. He 
he's really using the offstage play, which is really smart. Uh, especially for your advantage with um, Katara's. Oh no, I panicked. <laughs> Shoot. Yeah, J Ride X actually isn't that bad. Don't hold your sig, buddy. Not unless you know for sure that you can really hit those. Like I'm talking, really hit those. There's there's been times where I've been hit by six like that, and it it really sucks. I'm supposed to use six a little bit less too, by the way, but you know. All right, two zero. Let's keep going. Just keep going. It's gonna go on that fifty four streak. Oh god damn. I don't even know how many like games we've been playing, but. We're just going to keep going. Jala. So whenever it's black, you know they've been playing for a while. So what am I going to expect here? Axe as a main weapon, sword as a kill, or axe as a kill weapon and sword as a main? So, and as you can see, oh, he throws away for the sword. I think he knows what to expect. He is using his... Um, He's using it really well, which is really interesting for sure. I was expecting him to do something else, but I guess not. And he's dead, so I um, was hoping that he'd be more of a challenge uh, right there, but I guess there's the dodge in. That's what I like to see, Jala. Don't forget about your minds. It's probably gonna do yeah I knew it only Jala mains dude nice dodge in I should really use that I don't think I think it messed up with timing specifically for his part because I don't think anybody just dodges in like that neutral light might kill okay I was hoping that it wouldn't neutral light might kill okay good never mind I'm not that dark red yet Sidelight my kill? It does. Enough force from mid-range on Enigma. I just gotta be very careful here. I gotta, like, actually start using my movement. Um, neutral light is just what he's going to use. Side air is dropping. Side light to cover space. And that's it. That's the end of his stock. He wasn't that bad. I'm actually not going to lie. Uh, for me to get hit by a standing opponent is actually arguably uh, my fault. So not saying that he's a spammer. I'm just going to say I'm bad. I honestly got to get really good at not being red like that or whatever it is. So let's just keep going. Ragnar Neb. All right, a nice uh, home uh, home team color, uh, Ragnar here. Neb, I will salute you for that. That's an awesome color. I love that color scheme. I don't know what he's doing though. Um, dodge in, spot dodge. Axe recovery, axe everything, lots of spot dodges, which is a very annoying thing to deal with, especially for someone like me. I actually act upon string and not upon read, which is still a thing that I gotta really train myself not to do. Double side light, actually kind of effective for moving yourself and spacing off the stage, so that was really good. Oh, just a touch, just a tip right there. Just epic. Oh, and using it as a spike off the wall. Neb, just working out here, dude. 
I just wanted to kill him right away, but I guess not. Okay. Yeah, I'm bad. I'm actually just bad. I actually wanted to do something else. If that's how you want to be, Neb, I will. That was my fault. I guess he didn't touch the ground at some point. Okay, after this we have to play some hammer. Instant wake up. Something I should really avoid doing. Spot dodge again. Ooh, he caught me with that too. Neutral light. Neutral light again, might kill. Side light might kill. Dropping side air. Ballsy move from him. I should have stayed on the ground and there's the kill. Oh, stay on the ground, Seth. Sometimes if they're going for the sink, you can just hit them, man. I don't know what I'm doing. All right, let's keep going up the ladder. We're doing pretty good. It's just going in there and just dealing with some people. We have to adapt. We have to, we have to avoid. Okay, Mirage. Okay, at this level, I'm expecting strings. So, even if he doesn't have the reeds, he might have the strings. If he doesn't have the strings, he has the reeds. So, we gotta be careful with Scythe here. Um, he's he, he knows what's good. Nice dodge away. At least we know what to follow up with next time. Dodge away. Oh, dodge upward. Neutral light into side light. I actually didn't mean to down there, but I guess it worked out. The one thing that's great is that I have to take advantage whenever he does have scythe because I can actually get a lot out of the offstage play. Lots of dodges away. Dodges in. Dodged in again. Side sink. Oh, no follow up. Normally, someone will follow up with that with a side light or a side sig or something. I guess he doesn't want to doesn't want to play me right there. He is in the full right to take control, um, and he kind of forgot about the wall touch. Ever since they implemented that, the games actually go by so much more faster, but more fluent than they used to, which is something I'm really happy about. Side sig because it's safe right now. Hammer throw into neutral light. Recovery. Dodge down. Dodge up. There you go. Oh, I wasn't expecting that. I was thinking that he wouldn't go for a ground pound. I was thinking like a down air. Lots of uh, safer moves that could be chosen at his behalf. But that's okay. That's why we're here. We're all here to learn, my friend. We're all here to learn. All right. Mirage finished off. I was actually... In, oh, I didn't mean to report. <laughs> it's okay, dude. Uh, yeah, that guy was actually not that bad. Back to 1300. Let's just keep going, man. Let's keep going. We're not going to learn anything until I actually start facing people around where I really should be. So I should, I'm not proud of anything that I'm doing. I'm just happy that I'm learning and trying to warm up the basics again. Because the thing that sucks is that once you're in a high elo and you get a few losses, a black crossover for Mirage. Oh, and for Nyx. Might be a main. Hopefully not Guns. Guns is going to be a good matchup against Lance. So, I 
Oh, it's a lance player. Lance recovery is always such a perfect move for someone that's aggressive like me. Um, it's used off the stage. It's used on the stage. It's such a perfect move because I honestly hate it. I'm not going to lie to you. I really do. And I don't know why um, it's not used more. It's honestly such a perfect thing just to pop out there. And I think it can lead into a few strings. So, might be a gun main. Oh, I hit from the tip. And side sick. Side sick, I always have as a wake up whenever they try to go for an aerial attack and miss. Um, it's honestly just the one safe move I have that covers enough space. So I've always used it no matter what. It's just a thingy I get. Dodges up or jumps up, read. Nice side light. Could have downlighted though. I honestly think that would have been a better option in his case. But that's okay. He still has an opportunity to win this. Alright. There it is. A three stock again. Thank you very much. Good game. Evans... Lover? Evan Stover? Evan Stover. Alright. Let's just keep going. I don't know how long it's going to take for us to get our elo back, but we're just going to keep going here. And it is on. We are at Lucian a Gold used to be gold and is now in the 1300s. We are leering what I would like to call the place of no return. Nice sigs. Nice sigs. And perfect reads. Honestly, I am no match for the solution here because of guns. Guns is going to be the hardest thing for me to deal with unless I get these jump reads like I'm getting right now. Normally it's a hard thing to go for. So he goes for the sig finish. Yeah, he does. Recovery as well. Whip and toss. And recovery should finish him. Alright. I don't, wouldn't be surprised if he does down air or a move, something like that, to finish me off. Yeah. It's just that it's so perfect for someone with guns. He's a little bit floaty. So, okay, he's a little floaty. I can hit him with neutral airs or with a recovery like that or something, I guess. So... Dodge in for the weapon. Going back to the stage. Dodge back out. Yep, and the read was real. That was a hard read. I didn't think that he was going to do it. But my intuition told me something. Dodge up. Nice, perfect unarmed play by him. Dodge up. Oh, down, I mean. Follow with that. Oh, I was hoping I'd hit him off guard. Literally the day that Lance, um, Lance Guitarist comes out, I'm going to be all on that legend. Neutrosig. Neutrosig read again, but I wasn't able to hit it. Side sig. Recovery not working. 
recovery. And side zig. It's just perfect, because they're going to be close, and if they whiff it, if they whiff it, it works all the time. Um, I also catch my fr I also catch my my friend off guard with that actually a lot. Ada, a black Ada. You know that they've been playing Ada for a while. They're going to get either have a good understanding of the sigs, spacing, and also your play style, especially because they're going to most likely be very passive. Consider going for the down air instead of the side air. And there's the neutral sag. Yeah. Honestly, this is the best part about Ada, is that she actually has like one of the best sigs in the game. Um they made it so that it doesn't pick up anymore on the ground, I think. Um So it's been a little bit Spin a little bit, uh, dodge away, side sig. It's been a little bit nerfed, but in all honesty, it's an epic read for anybody like me who is very floaty, who needs to get back to the stage somehow, who really has trouble with uh, spear. I don't know what Ada's doing. Um, sh her confidence is gone because she was doing really well here. But side sake to finish me off just barely. Oh, down sig? That was down sig, I think. No, down sig moves you back. Neutral sig, yeah, that was side sig. If I can't be on her, I have to be close to her. Oh, I want to turn around. Cider. Yes, Whew, I was going to go for the down there again. Um, I think with Ada's health in the ceiling, I might have been able to do it off the top, but I didn't want to take my chances. Koji. Animated sword has the Koji skin. Willing to spend money in this game, just like me. And most likely is gonna main the sword. Uh, it's, it's a hard read on this one. Unless he's really good with bow, which I think he might be as well. So let's just be careful here. This is gold. So these are like platinums and everybody trying to like get back into it. You know, that's normally how it is in gold. Oh, normally it would have been smart to go for the ground pound, but that's okay. Like for his part, there I would have died if I hit the ground pound. Perfect. Just. Uh, that was not supposed to happen. I do like a weapon toss all the time towards people like this, so. Nice dodges away, which is something that uh, is pretty damn effective. Side sig, hoping to catch him off guard. Neutral sig, wake up. Down sig. And I'm not gonna wake up that way, buddy. And there it is. He's probably going to go for the ground air. I actually tried to go for... Or ground air. Tried to go for the dare. I actually tried to 
go for a D sig but messed up. So at least I know that my option can be very amazing with the neutral air. Especially the fact that it hits behind just a little bit, which is awesome. Oh, <laughs> no, the three stock. Yeah, I'm a little salty gamer time. That is actually a little bit sad. Oh no, there's no way. There's no way, unless he dodged. Um, dodged up possibly could have got away from the ground pound, but that's okay. That's all good on his part. He tried, I'll give him that. So this is the area of the video where it's probably gonna get not as talky anymore because we're gonna be focusing hard, just trying to get on that climb, trying to get back to at least 1400 or something. <sighs> I don't know how long we've been doing this for, so. I actually effed up, still watching the recording, and then uh, freaking, um, you know. Down air. Epic reads and off the ceiling he goes that was actually really good on his part i'm actually really bad at that so i just wasn't fast enough and off the ceiling hopefully again and off the ceiling again. That's epic. You just have to be really fast with Scarlet because Scarlet is sadly just not that epic of a legend, especially with the stats that I chose for her. I really wanted to get that dexterity because I think it would be a little bit more easier for me to hit the combos or just strings at this point. No read on the dodge in. Good option though. This is where it gets a little bit slow. Because I really don't know what to do sometimes, especially when I'm in the lead. Um, it does get a little bit pressury. Um, oh, neutral sick. Neutral sick again, Seth. He's not going to expect it. Oh, he DC'd. This is when the bot destroys me. Alright, and we did it. That was insane. Wasn't really thinking that that would work out, but it did. So, yeah. Wow, epic. Can we get to 1400, guys? Can we break the mold and get back to where we actually kind of were just before this video started? <laughs> I don't know. Let's just see. I don't have any faith. Like. <laughs> All right, a dusk. Dusk is actually oh, very amazing. Very amazing. Three, two, one, fall. All right. Throw. Oh, side sig didn't hit. Side sig and dead. Okay, good. Who go fast to clean up the board. Instant wake up. Toss. Pick up into instant wake up. Pick up. Recovery down air. Gravity cancel neutral light. Side neutral sig. And side air to kill. Let's just hurry up, please, bro. Another one. Another read. Just on his part, it's just it's really good. Such a good sig, it's a little bit faster than I expect, so. Ooh, neutral. I think neutral light should end. 
Like right there, it shouldn't it? Like it really should, but. Yeah, this is, this is the part of the game where it's really <laughs> He didn't recover back. Oh no, that's okay, dude. Honestly, it freaking happens. It honestly happens. And we're back to gold. Amazing feat reached here. I just really hope that Diana doesn't come. Okay, we faced lots of levels of Diana. This level around gold is going to be a little bit more difficult because they're going to have some bowstrings, um, even if it's not guns, because sadly, what's really dumb is that it doesn't matter what level of Diana you are, it doesn't require any skill to hit any of those combos. Um, actually, no, I lie. Like Some of it does require some reads, but... This guy here, for example, has a few of those reeds down. Uh, always the same reed. Should probably consider. That was actually just like out of instinct to throw it against a wall. instantly follow up all the time, which is not always a good thing. Sire. That was actually smooth as butter. Diana. Even though it wasn't on the stage, um, that was actually pretty freaking nasty. <laughs> All right, you have to jump. I'm a little bit too high for that, Diana. Oh, he dodged away. He's gonna try to look for a kill, which is going to be very epic for me. Because I can possibly get away. Oh, if you didn't space that wrong, you would have got me. That was a nice try, Diana. That was actually an epic try. Back at 1400. Alright, let's go here. I also can follow up with a Nair if I've chased Dodge up, but I keep forgetting. Orion, so always expect the SIGs. Neutral SIGs always good. Um... Disconnected Ninja Chicken J. We better take advantage of this. Before he comes back. Yeah, that side sig is very broken. Um, it's, it's not broken, okay? It's easily dodgeable. There's a few frames that, you know, that you can actually get out of it from it, I think the only thing that makes it broken is that um, people just will not expect there to be <laughs> this was actually him I would have been f that would have been funny though but yeah like what's really dumb I guess is the fact that there's the extra there's the extra frames uh, that come out right the extra hitboxes so it gets a little bit annoying to remember that if I'm off the stage or I do something like this, there's actually more to it than just that. Um, probably follow with the down air again. Throw. Throw. Oh, man. Okay. Oh, my God, man. I wasn't thinking that he'd leave though. 
All right, and we're back, dude. We're like 200 elo away. I don't know if I want to continue. Because this is part of the video where it's just going to get harder and harder to get up. Because lots of people up here, man. They're actually they're actually good. Um, I'm not going to deny that fact. Like, this Scarlet, if I get beat by Scarlet, guys, it's demoralizing as hell. It's like losing at a game that you mastered for 10 years. And you're like, how am I bad, right? So he actually might jump up or dodge up. Nice. Yeah, that's why I honestly hate going against other Scarlets. It's not that they're bad or good or whatever. It's just the psychological damage of losing to your own main. That's something you just can't take back. Oh, I thought I was the only person that does that. That was actually pretty good. That was well played. Neutral light might kill. Cider. I actually didn't mean to do that, but it worked out. It worked out in its favor. A little bit yellow. Normally when it comes down to like having a stock lead, you do want to get just as much damage as you possibly can. Especially when you're unarmed in neutral game like this, it's a little bit harder, especially because of the f just the forces, especially with the weapon. I gotta talk to him. He's a Scarlet man. So. Oh. <laughs> Not a cloud left. GG, man. G freaking G. <sighs> Alright. Let's keep climbing. God dang. Oh yeah, the bots hit the neutral light like perfect every time. <laughs> they hit the neutral light perfect. And I don't get it sometimes because it's like, dude, how do you do that, dude? How do you even do that? The bots like have frame perfect input and everything. Yeah, so for someone like Nyx, I don't want to go with a weapon such as um, Hammer. That I'm uncomfortable with because of the fact that it's Lance against Scythe is a little bit more of a better matchup in my point, in my uh, in my uh, experience. Perfect. He if he held that, like if I messed up. He had no jump. Oh, that was perfect. Oh, he went for Coca. That was actually smart. Using the ledge, she won't have to commit all the way, allowing him to discontinue, which is actually just the perfect option for him. And, oh my god, man.
I float a lot, so I gotta be very careful here. Yeah, normally people will move in, so as you can see, he's really good at reading. There's to an extent of which he can read, and I am going to literally applaud that. doing at this point. Oh, I didn't think that the weapon would just come down. I guess that was uh, perfect. Especially side sig. Watch out for D sig and neutral sig and everything. Down air to recovery could have been a better option for him. Down there again. Should have just committed with that. Throw. Weapon toss. Oh! That was perfect! Neutral sick, of course. Going off from the slide, I didn't think that my hitbox would be able to hit um, his um, those frames there, but I guess I was wrong. I'm unarmed. He knows my dodges, I think. Just a little bit. I committed. I actually let go, but uh, the lag. <laughs> so that was actually just a, that was his luck at that point. Thank the God, like the good Lord, that he stayed. GG. You're good. Not gonna lie. Yeah, I hope he gets a higher gold, dude, because he's not that bad. Thanks, man. GG, well played. GG, well played, man. Honestly, honestly, um... I think, I think I pressured to, I, I pressured you harder. You, you had pretty good movement. I tried to keep the pace up so you would panic if you missed the dodge, but <laughs> it all happens. <laughs> would you believe me if I said I started today from 900? No, 975. 975. <laughs> it took me an hour and 20 minutes to get back up here. An hour and 20 minutes. Well, yeah, I could see that being a mad Scarlet Streak. <laughs> yeah, recording it too. Yeah, recording it too. You on rank grind or you want to do some influence for, for, for something? I actually did ask. Yeah, I'm I'm pooped. Alright, so that's great. <laughs> Dude, I think I'm done. I think I'm happy with the grind. That was an hour and twenty five minutes and we were able to climb. 
that was uh, from 900. That was 500 ELO, dude. We climbed 500 ELO in an hour and 40 minutes. So, thanks for watching. I don't know if I'm going to upload this. I think I will.